Welcome to a skewed chimp. I posted a video not too long ago, and in it I kind of said that I had some stuff going on and I might not be able to post as regularly as I used to. As it turns out, this is true, and I'll share some of those reasons with you just in case you're curious. There are a couple of reasons that I'm not going to be able to post as much, at least for the near future, and maybe for a little while, but I will still post. I want to be clear about that. I will still be posting. But one of the reasons that I am not going to be able to post as often is because I have several other projects that also take a lot of time and focus that I really don't have time to juggle with this project as often as I would like to. Making videos and doing the voice editing and getting all of the pieces together in addition to trying to build something and sharpen tools. There's just a lot of moving parts here and it's kind of hard to coordinate all of this in the middle of the rest of my life when I have additional projects going on there as well. The complications of trying to juggle many projects are only exacerbated by the fact that it is now holiday season and I think we all know that because we there's no escaping it. It's everywhere. So uh, it's the middle of the holiday season, and it's quite difficult uh, to manage those things even under the best of circumstances, much less when trying to make videos of me horsing around in my garage. And on the note that it's the holidays, it's cold right now, and I don't have any heat, and I don't have any insulation. I do have a portable heater, but for those of you that remember my garage, that's just not a good idea to run a heater in this environment. Oh, oh God, no. So, some of you may also recall from a previous video where I showed you that my garage is actually attached to several other garages. And they're not real walls between each of the garage spaces. And since they're not heated or insulated, that means the air flows freely from one garage, one connected garage, to the other connected garages, including mine. Because it's wintertime, People are starting their cars and allowing them to idle, which means at times I'm getting tear gassed or monoxified or uh, poisoned, essentially, by people idling their cars in their garage because there's not enough ventilation and my choice is to either open the door and freeze and clear out some of the smells or sit there inhaling it. So it makes working in the garage a little bit more difficult at this time of year. Each of the people that are using their garages, by the way, means they're opening and closing their garage door, turning on lights and what have you. And also, some of you might recall, I share a breaker with each of the attached garages. And it's very sensitive to begin with. So the idea of going out and having to throw a breaker because it popped because too many people are using their garages at once in the winter is not fun. So that also inhibits me. Also because of the weather right now, it makes doing things like sharpening tools really difficult because not only am I shivering, which is a bad idea with exceptionally sharp tools in your hand, uh, but also because the water that gets into the sharpening stone could then freeze suddenly on me and shatter the stone. So I have to pick and choose my days right or I have to move the sharpener and it's just this big hassle. In any case, it's a lot more work than it looks like. And yet one more reason is, uh, without getting too political, which unfortunately this is a political topic these days, uh, as I'm sure, I mean, there's no escaping it, everybody knows, we are in the COVID-19 era. I am trying to protect myself and my family, as well as those around me who are not immediately part of my household as best I can. And in order to do that, I'm limiting my exposure to others. I would encourage everybody watching this to do the same. And so that makes getting out to get tools and supplies a little bit more difficult uh, for me. So for all these reasons, plus a few others that I'm sure you don't need to know, not that you needed to know any of the others, but um, for all these reasons and a couple of others, I may not be posting videos as often in the future as I did in the past. Thank you so much for your support, your comments, your feedback. I actually appreciate hearing from you all to hear what I could do better or do differently. It's entertaining for me. It's a social thing, and if it wasn't for other people, I wouldn't be doing it at all. Stay safe, happy holidays, and wear a mask correctly every time. It's not that goddamned hard.